What's up, Crypto Land? You know what? I'm sorry to tell you, but cryptocurrencies are here to stay. I mean, they're not going anywhere. They're still not going anywhere. And every time you look around, some big company is still getting involved in terms of cryptocurrency, whether it's, of course, all of these big, large funds, you know, like the whole BlackRock and you have ARK and Vesco, all of these different funds that are trying to get their ETF, of course, approved. And you have, of course, conglomerates like PayPal that is still getting involved when it comes to Bitcoin and cryptocurrencies. But of course, you as an individual, you keep on saying to yourself, I'm gonna get away from it. So what if, of course, cryptocurrencies go all the way up in price? I mean, one of the things that you're gonna to have to keep in mind is this might be an elaborate plan. So for instance, Bitcoin, what if Bitcoin goes to, of course, $100,000? What if it goes to $500,000? What if it goes to, of course, a million dollars? Where are you gonna be on that entire scale? You know, um, if you have a little tiny piece of, of course, Bitcoin, we've already seen, of course, with other cryptocurrencies and of course, Bitcoin from the early days, that that price can soar over a extended period of time. So let's just say over the next 10 years, right? Bitcoin goes to a million dollars. If it's around, of course, you know, where it's at right now and where it's sitting, and we still have a little bit of a fear, of course, with it, going from you know between twenty five to twenty eight thousand dollars or so imagine if that goes to a million dollars and if you only had maybe a hundred dollars in or a thousand dollars in you would have a really good amount in that terms but the problem is a lot of people want to get rich quick now this has always been a long-term play a long term in terms of outlook in terms of investments when you talk about real investors they're not looking for a quick flip. They have a plan in terms of a three, five, 10 year plan when it comes to that. So of course now, with it going to that, you also have to keep in mind the mathematics of, of course, cryptocurrencies or the mathematics of Bitcoin. For instance, the market cap of Bitcoin alone, if it goes to 500,000 or so, it needs to be around $10 trillion. Can it happen? Absolutely. I mean, that's just a few companies, of course, putting Bitcoin on their balance sheets. Now, when it comes to going to a million dollars, you're looking at around $20 trillion that the entire market cap of Bitcoin needs to be. And can that happen? Absolutely. Of course, when you look at other asset classes in terms of their market cap, of course, it is comparable. So once everybody starts to get on board in terms of Bitcoin, you're gonna definitely see Bitcoin in terms of its market cap in the trillions. And of course, that means that we're gonna at least probably see a hundred thousand dollars when it comes to Bitcoin we've already seen it go all the way up to sixty thousand dollars so is it really that far-fetched that Bitcoin may reach of course a hundred thousand dollars no so that the only question is is where are you going to be on that scale are you going to allow them to scare you out of the market and then in the next few years, when you cannot even buy Bitcoin because the price is so high, to acquire a small piece of it will cost you so much that then at that time you would think it's not worth it because you missed out today when you could have, of course, gotten it at such a cheaper price in terms of this asset class. That's what you have to think about okay there are a lot of people that i know who has bitcoin and they've already sold all of their bitcoin because of all of the fear in the market because of all of the scams that's going on in the market they're paying attention more to those bad stories than all of the good stories or ideas that are around the technology itself and that's what a lot of the bigger companies and the conglomerates are banking on so that of course when you're least expected the price is going to shoot up and it's going to shoot up very quickly i mean much quicker than you've seen some of the other bull runs of course when you see that take over of course a year a year and a half in terms of a bull run you might see a bull run over the matter of a few months and we're talking about leaps and bounds in terms of tens of thousands of dollars and maybe hundreds of thousands of dollars but at that point you obtaining one Bitcoin is going to be so far 
above your means that you're not going to be able to get involved. And I don't want you to miss out. So definitely right now, if you can, make sure put some Bitcoin on your balance sheet. I don't care if you hold it, give it to your family, give it to your kids, whatever. Put it inside of a wallet and store it on the side and don't ever think about it. That's what you're going to have to do. Think about it. Don't get left out. Black Crypto out.